it's frustrating because who knows between October and last Friday, what if I would have died from this? I mean, I'm not trying to be dramatic or anything, but personally, I'm just irritated that the insurance companies have so much power over doctors trying to get their patients what they need. My mother was concerned because she was there one time. I fell asleep on the couch and uh, I stopped breathing. And, you know, she started screaming at me and I, uh, I came around. And so I had a sleep study, I think before I saw her and at home, because that's, they wouldn't authorize the the one where you go into the lab overnight and there's a technician there that's monitoring you. So I did that and the uh, results were inconclusive or not enough time. This is a man I was very worried about. Because the data indicated severe sleep disorder breathing, as a knowledgeable sleep physician, I wanted to take him into the lab uh, prove uh, the uh, degree of sleep disorder breathing and treat him both in the same night and that's a split night study so that's what I ordered and that was denied and they wanted and they said maybe a home sleep study well that's about eight months that, that, that I, I took for me to get the actual in the lab study I understand uh, I need a machine badly.